The human body is a complex and intricate system, presenting a considerable challenge for delivering drugs effectively. For a drug to exert its therapeutic effect, it must reach its target site in the body at a sufficient concentration. This journey involves a series of hurdles, from the initial administration to the final absorption into the bloodstream. This is where drug delivery systems come into play, acting as the crucial bridge between a drug and its intended therapeutic effect. Drug delivery systems encompass a wide range of technologies and strategies aimed at optimizing the transport of drugs within the body. These systems are designed to enhance drug absorption, improve bioavailability, and target specific tissues or cells. By controlling the rate, time, and location of drug release, these systems ensure that the drug reaches its intended destination in a safe and effective manner. The success of any pharmaceutical product hinges on the efficiency of its delivery system, making it a critical aspect of drug development. Imagine a lock and key mechanism where the drug is the key and the body's cells are the lock. For the key to unlock the therapeutic potential, it needs to reach the lock and fit perfectly. Drug delivery systems act as the guiding force, ensuring that the key, drug, not only reaches the lock, target site, but also fits snugly, maximizing its effect. This process involves navigating various biological barriers and physiological processes, all while maintaining the drug's stability and effectiveness. The importance of drug delivery systems cannot be overstated. They are instrumental in determining the success of a pharmaceutical product, influencing its efficacy, safety, and ultimately, its impact on patient outcomes. A well-designed drug delivery system can mean the difference between a groundbreaking treatment and an ineffective one. By understanding the principles governing drug absorption and transport, scientists can develop innovative solutions that overcome the challenges of drug delivery and pave the way for more effective therapies. At the heart of drug absorption lies the concept of passive membrane permeability. This fundamental process dictates how drugs traverse the biological membranes that enclose our cells and tissues. Essentially, it's the ability of a drug molecule to move through these barriers without requiring any external energy input. This passive movement is driven by the concentration gradient, with molecules naturally migrating from areas of high concentration to those of lower concentration. Several factors influence a drug's ability to permeate cell membranes. One crucial factor is the drug's lipophilicity, or its affinity for fats. Cell membranes are primarily composed of lipids, so drugs with a higher lipophilicity can more readily dissolve into and pass through these membranes. Conversely, hydrophilic drugs, those with an affinity for water, face greater difficulty in penetrating these lipid barriers. Another key factor is molecular size. Smaller drug molecules can navigate through the membrane's pores and channels more easily than larger molecules. This size-dependent permeability acts as a sieve, allowing smaller molecules to pass while hindering larger ones. The chemical structure and charge of the drug molecule also play a role, influencing its interactions with the membrane components and ultimately affecting its permeability. Understanding passive membrane permeability is crucial in pharmaceutical development. By considering these factors, scientists can predict a drug's ability to reach its target site and optimize its formulation for enhanced absorption. This knowledge guides the design of drug delivery systems that facilitate efficient drug transport across biological barriers, ultimately improving the effectiveness of pharmaceutical therapies. Drug flux is a critical concept in understanding the rate at which a drug moves across a membrane. It quantifies the amount of drug that permeates a given area of the membrane per unit of time. This movement is driven by the concentration gradient of the drug across the membrane, with a higher gradient resulting in a faster flux. Fick's law, a fundamental principle in physics, describes this relationship mathematically. Fick's law states that the drug flux is directly proportional to the concentration gradient and the membrane permeability coefficient. 
This coefficient represents the ease with which a drug can traverse the membrane, taking into account factors like lipophilicity and molecular size. A higher permeability coefficient translates to a faster drug flux, indicating a more efficient transport across the membrane. Imagine a river flowing downhill, where the slope represents the concentration gradient and the river's width represents the membrane permeability coefficient. A steeper slope and a wider river result in a faster flow of water, analogous to a higher drug flux. Similarly, a higher concentration gradient and a greater permeability coefficient lead to a more rapid movement of drugs across the membrane. Drug flux is a key determinant of drug absorption and ultimately its bioavailability. A higher flux indicates a faster rate of drug entry into the bloodstream, leading to a quicker onset of action and potentially higher drug concentrations at the target site. Understanding and quantifying drug flux is therefore crucial in optimizing drug delivery systems and ensuring the efficacy of pharmaceutical therapies. Oral administration is the most common and convenient route for drug delivery. However, the journey of a drug taken orally is far from straightforward. It involves a complex series of steps, each with its own set of challenges. Upon swallowing, the drug encounters the harsh environment of the stomach, where acidic gastric juices and digestive enzymes can degrade the drug molecule. If the drug survives the stomach's onslaught, it then enters the small intestine, the primary site for drug absorption. Here, the drug must navigate through the intestinal lining, a selectively permeable barrier that regulates the passage of substances into the bloodstream. The intestinal lining is lined with villi, finger-like projections that increase the surface area for absorption. Once absorbed into the bloodstream, the drug encounters the liver, a metabolic powerhouse that can further modify or eliminate the drug. This first-pass metabolism can significantly reduce the amount of drug that ultimately reaches the systemic circulation and its target site. Overcoming these barriers and ensuring adequate absorption is a critical challenge in oral drug delivery. The process of oral absorption is a complex interplay of physical, chemical, and biological factors. Understanding these factors is essential for designing drug formulations and delivery systems that optimize drug absorption and bioavailability. Factors such as drug solubility, dissolution rate, and permeability across the intestinal lining all play a crucial role in determining the success of oral drug delivery. Pion Incorporated is at the forefront of developing innovative solutions for drug delivery, addressing the challenges of membrane permeability, drug flux, and gastrointestinal barriers. The company's cutting-edge technologies aim to enhance drug absorption, improve bioavailability, and ultimately revolutionize pharmaceutical therapies. Pion Solutions focus on overcoming gastrointestinal barriers, improving drug solubility and permeability, and controlling drug release kinetics. Pion Incorporated is committed to advancing drug delivery technologies, paving the way for more effective and patient-centric therapies. Its dedication to innovation and scientific excellence is transforming the pharmaceutical landscape, bringing hope to patients worldwide.